The Great Gatsby. I haven't talked about, thought about, or even touched this book for years. This used to be my favorite novel. It may still be. I just haven't read it in a long time. But my friend Yvette was, I was talking with her tonight about something. I hope she doesn't mind me using her name. And she was talking about a family situation with uh, relationships. And uh, she was talking about how she can't go back to those past relationships, but she can make the relationships she, she has now better. And I thought it really reminded me of Gatsby, that, that line of Gatsby, which I found in Chapter 6, where um, Nick, the narrator, lives next door to Gatsby. And uh, Nick, here, here's Nick. Nick lives next door to Gatsby. And Gatsby was in love with Daisy, but da Gatsby went away to make his fortune and come back because Daisy said that uh, rich girls don't marry poor boys, so he went off to make his fortune. He came back, though, and she had already married um, Tom Buchanan. So Gatsby's back now, and he's rich, and he wants to, he still wants Daisy, but and he has the money now, and but Daisy's married, so he's trying to recreate the situation where they were in love, but now this time he has the money, and Jace, I'm sorry, Nick, the narrator, says to Jay Gatsby, I wouldn't ask too much of her, you can't repeat the past. And Gatsby says, can't repeat the past, he cried incredulously. Why, of course you can. And to me, that's really the whole gist of the book. The whole gist of the book is Gatsby's trying to recreate the past, which is impossible. The past is now, I mean, the present, the past is gone, and the present is what it is now. So I think it just made me realize that there are times when I do try to recapture um, the past relationships I have. Now, sometimes I'll see old friends and we pick up where we left off and it's as if nothing changed. But really, in reality, I can make those relationships that I have with my friends and family better. And uh, I don't have to try to recapture some kind of idealized perfect past that may never very well have existed. It's just in my memory and my point of view. But... Uh, that's that's what I was thinking of, and that's what The Great Gatsby had to offer for me today. So I hope this helps somebody out there, and thank you to my friend Yvette for bringing that to my mind, and I hope uh, somebody out there can be helped by this. Please put any comments in the uh, comment section below. I'd be interested to hear what you have to say about this.